Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Open TTD. Last we left up, we hooked up uh, Mazmont Station and also added a little passenger station over here. And if I call correctly, we had to add maybe some more trains. Yeah, there are a lot of passengers uh, starting to... Uh, uh, well, kind of clog up this station over here. So if we want to move them all, we should maybe uh, think about adding some more passenger rails. I'm not sure if the capacity of little trains like this will be enough to service uh, a huge station uh, like Bum and Rum, or a huge station, a pretty big station like Bum and Rum. So we can either add uh, a bigger train or just more routes on the same train. Oh, let's hold up for a minute. There's a train here that can't find a path. Why not? It's train 8 going from Mazmont to Zuidkomplik North. I didn't change any track, I think, over here. Oh no, it's just bitching because it's been in the station too long. We have to wait for other trains to pass over here. So actually, these little trains have a capacity of... Wow! That's like uh, 154, 56 passengers. It's pretty good actually. I guess we don't need to add any more trains. This will be fine. They're not the fastest train to these, but uh, the locomotives, which are the first and the last carriage, actually also hold passengers. So they're uh, quite an efficient way to move things around. Anyway, we can go ahead and add another station over here. And that's exactly what we are going to do. Just figuring out if we want the rail to come up over here. Or if we want to make a side track. I think we want to make a side track because otherwise every train going from anywhere here to here has to cross this uh, gigantic hill. I think it will be better if uh, the main road going through here, ooh, a helicopter, will have uh, some kind of tunnel or just follows the coast. That way uh, long range trains will be way more efficient. So let's start a station. Think about three tracks. Length of four. Should supply everything right here. These are all very, very expensive tracks because we're building on farmland. But it doesn't really matter. We are loaded. We are really to start starting to make bank with all our trains. So basically we can afford any big construction project we want right now. Which is great. Not having to worry about money or loans anymore. And there we go. So the right side is in and the left side is out. Let's extend these tracks. So we can make a little intersection. Uh, you know what? I'm going to, uh, since it's coming from quite a big height anyway, we can make a smart big intersection over here with bridges. So let's see, I think like this because. Yeah, just because. We'll have these coming up from over here. 
and add two little bridges like so just to give them a little bit more space oh no that's wrong I should have gone to the side if I want to keep this symmetrical which I do there we go this should work I always say that by the way even if it doesn't it just gives me the confidence you know uh, let's add a signal here another one here uh, guess to here and to here yes we should actually probably test it uh, to see if it even works before we start adding lots and lots of trains on these lines uh, yeah, going to need a few more signals over here like so Let's buy a train for these a new vehicle of course one of the expensive ones no no not rename buy vehicle uh, let's start with a coal truck Because we only need to uh, transport one kind of goods from the coal mine and two kind of goods from uh, the farm. Let's see, our power station was. Wait, is, where is our power station? Coal is coming from. Oh, right over here. I might actually have to expand that station in a while. Anyway, uh, it's gonna fully load any cargo and unload everything right here while not loading. <laughs> it's already lost. Uh, let's stop the train. It should be... Oh, those signals are the wrong way around. That's better. Let's make it turn around. For a second. And come out. Is it going the right way now? Yes, it is. That's step one. Now, will it take this intersection? No, it will not. Because I screwed up the signals. Wait. This is the in route. Yeah, I screwed them up. Uh, let's go like this for a second so we can actually change the intersection stop the train so the in track needs to be connected like this and this and the out track yeah should be connected the other way around yeah that makes way more sense actually <laughs> now i think about it uh let's add the signal back turn this train around because we can magically do that and right it's still not going no, of course not, because this is an in-track and the signal is the wrong way around. No, wait. This signal is the wrong way around. This one as well. I really did not think about this long enough. Uh, let's not do that. Let's get one over here. Yes, I know you can leave. Round. Uh, 
There we go. That took like no effort whatsoever. Let's arrive at Masmon Mines. Let's see if it can get out. No, because I screwed up that once again. There we go. We'll get this working in no time. I'm not sleepy or tired or anything. Don't you believe what they say? <laughs> so let's follow this train for a second. It's going all the way around. These trucks are actually uh, backing up quite a bit. I might have to do something about that. This is a long way for a train to go. Does it at least make a lot of money? Well, 50k. It's pretty good. Uh, but because it's such a long way, we're going to need more trains. Low run. See how many tons of coal it can actually take. Really not that many. Oh, it produces 270. Clone it again. And again, I guess. Since money isn't really an option, we better just uh, give the station good coverage. There we go, train 18 is back. Just done one full round. Train 19 is on its way back, but it's just not fast enough. We're gonna need another train. It's crazy, we have like... This is train... Train 22, so we have five gold trains now. And this one station. <laughs> it's a little bit of ridiculous, but it's just such a long way for transporting the coal. It should, I think it will steadily decrease now. Are there any gold trains on their way back? Hmm, there might not be. So, anyway, we hooked up these coal mines this episode and that's why i'm going to leave it as this thank you all for watching and i'll see you next episode